Chapter 1 Unit 1 Make a call Urgent Bother Earpiece Trunk call Manual telephone Hotline Speak to somebody. Get in contact with somebody. A late phone call. Telephone book. Local call. Emergency call. Telephone subscriber. This is Grace. Could I speak to Eddie? May I speak to Richard in marketing? Hello, is Richard there? Could you connect me to the head of your department? Hi, I need to talk to the person who is in charge of production facility. Hello, Miss Smith, please. I need to speak with him urgently. I have something urgent to consult Miss Leo about. I am calling to return Mr. Chang's phone call. Please put him on. I'm calling on Mr. Jones's behalf. Put me through to the sales department, please. I'm calling to give my congratulations to you. I'm calling to report the recent developments to you. I'm calling to confirm the appointment for this afternoon. I'm calling to place an order for your products. He is out of the office right now. He's out of town now. He's in a meeting right now. Hello, could I speak to Richard, please? Yes, what can I do for you? Is this Jason, please? Jason isn't here right now. I'm sorry to call you so early, but I have to inform you that our meeting had been canceled. Don't say that. I appreciate it. Is Grace in? Hold on. I'll get her for you. How can I help you? Please put me through to exports. Hello. I hope I didn't catch you at a bad time. May I speak to Bill, please? I'm sorry, but Bill is busy. Good afternoon, DB Company. Oh, good afternoon. May I have the pleasure to speak with Mr. Johnson? Who shall I say is calling? It's Juana Brown. Please hold, and I'll see if he's available. I'm sorry, but Mr. Johnson just left the office. When will he be back? He won't be back today. That's so bad. Unit 2 Call Back Call 4 On Behalf of Hang On Available Later Redial Talk to somebody. In behalf of. Hold on. Convenient. Available. Hello, Lucy speaking. May I help you? This is Mary calling from Beijing office. Hello, this is Lily from X Company. May I help you? 
Hello, Wilson Toy Company. Who is that speaking, please? Who is that calling, please? Can I ask who's calling? May I have your name, please? May I ask who you are calling for? May I ask who you wish to talk to? May I ask who you wish to speak to? Who in particular would you like to talk to? Who do you wish to talk to? This is Black speaking. Speaking. Susan speaking. Hello. How may I direct your call? Hello. I am trying to reach David Hacker. Who are you looking for? I would like to speak to Mr. Sato. Mr. Lee, you are wanted on the phone. Okay, thank you. May I ask who you are calling for? I'm looking for Dr. Lee. Is he in? Is this the sales department? I beg your pardon? Hello, is this 01086128816? Yes. Whom are you calling? Hello. This is Bob. Who is that, please? Oh, hello, Bob. This is Anna from DB Company. Hello, Anna. What can I do for you? I just want to clear up a few details of the exhibition we are organizing. Right. What do you need to know? I just want to know how many companies will attend the exhibition. So far, we got 83 who booked up, and we might get a few more. Well, you'll let me know if you get the exact number, won't you? I'll email you as soon as I know. <laughs> Unit 3 Message Take a message. Repeat. Make sure. Voicemail. Pass a message. Leave a message. Call somebody back. As soon as possible. Promise. Check the voicemail. Phone number. Do you have a message? Is there any message? Do you wish to leave a message? I'll make sure that he gets the message. Can I leave Mr. Smith a message? Could you please take a message to Jake? I would like to leave a message. Make sure he gets the message. Would you tell him that Mike called? Please have him call me back. Would you please tell her to call me back? Would you like him to call you back? Will you call back later, or should I leave word for him to call you? How do you spell your name? Could you spell your name, please? Could you leave your number? Who shall I say is calling, please? Who is calling, please? Would you like to leave a message? No. I will call back later. Thank you. Bye. Can I leave a message? Sure. What's the message? Lee, Mr. Wong from X Company called you this morning. Did he leave a message? 
Catherine from X Company called you to invite you to the seminar. Thank you. I'm afraid I can't go. I will call her back in person. I'm sure to pass your message to Mr. Green. Thank you. Please tell her I will meet her 10 o'clock tomorrow morning at her office. Okay. Let me repeat your message to see if I've got it all. Hello, this is Lily. Can I speak to Mary? Please, wait a moment. Sorry, she is not in the office. Would you like to leave a message or call back later? I want Mary to call me back. Okay, I will have her call you back as soon as possible. May I have your name, please? Sure, I am Lily Alice. Could you spell your name, please? Yes. It's L-I-L-Y-A-L-I-C-E. Okay, does she know your number? I think she has my number, but I will leave my number just in case. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I got it. When should she try to reach you? Any time before six o'clock. Okay, I will let her call you later. Thank you. You are welcome. Unit 4 Connect Transfer Hold on No answer Switch somebody over Direct line Switchboard operator Put somebody through. Extension. Line. Just a minute. Put somebody online. Internal line. Operator. Do you know the extension of sales department? Please tell me the extension of marketing department. The extension number of sales department is 201. I'll connect you with our finance manager. Please hold on for just a minute. Can I put you through to his secretary? I'm transferring you to him. Please wait. I'm switching you over to Mr. Carter. I'll connect you to extension 102. I'm transferring your call to extension 105. Mr. Peck is on line 1. You're through now. I'm sorry, but Miss Jong's line is busy right now. Would you call back later? Mr. Huang is on another line right now. I'm afraid there's no answer. Sorry, Mr. Wilson's number is engaged. Do you know the extension of marketing department? Yes, the extension number of marketing department is 106. Hello, ABC Company. What can I do for you? Could you connect me with the reservation office? Could you connect me with your sales manager? Just a moment. I will transfer you. Hello, this is Grace. Can I speak to Tina? Just a minute. Tina, it's for you. Could you connect me with the sales department? Hold on for a minute. I will put you through now. I need to speak to Mr. Black from Sales Department urgently. I'll switch you over to Mr. Black. One second, please.
Good morning, ABC Company. What can I do for you? Good morning. This is Anna from DB Company. Can I have extension 847? Certainly. Please hold the line. I'll put you through. Bob Peterson's office. Peter speaking. This is Anna Smith speaking. Is Bob in? I'm afraid he's out at the moment. Can I take a message? Yes. Could you ask him to call me at 687 64391? I need to talk to him about the products. It's urgent. Could you repeat the number, please? Yes, that's six eight seven six four three nine one, and this is Anna Smith. Thank you, Miss Smith. I'll make sure Bob gets this ASAP. Thanks. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Unit 5 Free Make an appointment Urgent Confirm Have time to do Address Convenient Postpone one's appointment Cancel an appointment. Agenda. Schedule. Fix. What is the best time to phone you? I'm available next Monday. May I know when I could reach him? Well, Maybe you can speak to someone else. It's rather urgent. I am wondering if you have time to discuss our new proposal. I wanted to talk to you about that order. I'll put you through to Mr. Smith's secretary. Could you tell me the address again? I'll talk to you soon. I'll send you a fax to confirm this. Let me just confirm it. I wrote to Mr. Smith last week, and he sent me a fax asking me to call and make an appointment to see him in New York. I'd like to make an appointment with your finance manager. Could you tell me what you want to talk about? Yes, I am interested in your plan. When will it be convenient for you? Friday morning or afternoon. Is that convenient for you? Yes. Can we fix the meeting at 10 o'clock on Friday morning? Let me check. Yes. Right, I've got that. That suits me well. So, it's a deal. We will meet 10 a.m. tomorrow. I'm sorry. There are some special things to deal with. Could you postpone our appointment? Of course. Shall we say 10 o'clock on Friday morning? I'm afraid not, because I have informed others. Hello, Wilson Industries. What can I do for you? This is Mike Weber of Weber Industries. I have something important to discuss with your general manager. I'm calling to see if I can meet him tomorrow morning. Hold on, please. I'm checking his agenda. I'm afraid he won't be available tomorrow morning, so you might come over tomorrow afternoon. What time is convenient for him? Between 4 and 5, if that suits you. Okay, that suits me. Good. See you then. Thank you. See you. Unit 6 Rearrange Schedule Cancel Reschedule Due to Put off 
Postpone. Conference. Emergency. Agenda. Conflict. Instead. Can we put it off? Could we meet on Friday instead? There comes a very important customer. Please rearrange my schedule. My meeting with Annie is rearranged at 10 o'clock. We have to postpone our whole schedule one week. Plans always fall behind changes. I'm going to reschedule the agenda. They have made you visiting another day. Sorry, the conference with department manager is rescheduled at 9 a.m. They have advanced your meeting two hours according to you time schedule. The flight to Shanghai is canceled due to the bad weather. Our visiting is canceled for John's late flight. Our CEO will not come. He has another emergency to handle. Clear my schedule for the afternoon. I wonder if we could make it some other time. Sure. I'm calling to confirm your appointment for tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. with Mr. Parker. Actually, I do need to change the time of my appointment. I have a scheduling conflict. We'll just have to make it another time. What a pity. How about next week? We have an appointment this afternoon at 2. Can we reschedule for next week? That shouldn't be a problem. Could it be postponed, if possible, till Tuesday? That suits me well. I'm afraid he's going to be 15 minutes late for his meeting this afternoon. That's okay. Hi, my name is Zhang Lin. May I speak to Frank, please? Speaking. Hi, Frank. I'm calling to inform you that I can't keep our appointment tomorrow. I'm sorry to hear that. What happened? One of our clients arrived early and I have to meet him at the airport. I see. Would it be possible to postpone the appointment? Sure. When is convenient for you? I wonder if we could put off our meeting until next Wednesday. Yes, it's okay by me. Great. Hope I haven't messed up your arrangements too much. Not at all. <laughs> Unit 7. Dial. Wrong number. Area code. Look up. Try again. Correct. Miss dial. Check the number. Telephone directory. Change number. Nobody. Possible. There is no Chin at that number. There's no one named Anna here. Nobody by that name works here. There's no one by that name here. We don't have any William working here. Please look up the correct number in the telephone directory. I suggest you look in the phone book. Why don't you look it up in the phone book? You can check again with the phone book. You must have the wrong number. Sorry, you've got a wrong number. I must have dialed a wrong number. Sorry, wrong number.
He may have changed his number. He probably changed to a new number. Is it possible that she has changed her number? Sorry, I dialed wrong. I'm afraid I have the wrong number. Sorry for troubling you. Sorry, I have misdialed. It seems you've misdialed. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll check again. Are you sure you have the right name? Yes, I'm 100% sure. May I talk to Steve, please? I'm sorry, but I don't recognize that name. Is Patty there? I'm sorry, I'm afraid you've dialed the wrong number. There is no Patty here. I remember the number clearly. Isn't this 763? Four five six five. No, this is seven three six four five six five. You've misdialed. Hello, this is ABC Company. What can I do for you? Hello, this is Susan from Pan Pacific Tours. Can I speak to your sales manager, John? There's no one named John here. What number are you trying to dial? Three four seven six nine six seven eight three. Is that right? Sorry, this is the wrong number. Unit eight. Hang up. Hold the line. Pleasure. Look forward to. Apologize. Ring off. Call back. Appreciate. Get a call from somebody. Receive somebody's call. I'll look forward to receiving your call. I look forward to getting a call from you. My best wish to Olson. I'm sorry to have taken so much of your time. Sorry, I have no interest in your product. I'm going to hang up now. Have a nice day. Goodbye. Wish you a good day. Have a great day. Please say hello to everyone. Say hi to everyone for me. Thanks for calling. Bye. Nice talking to you. Goodbye. I'm glad, happy to talk with you. It's great talking to you. It's been a pleasure talking to you. Talk to you later. Time to go. I got to hang up. Well, I have to go. I appreciate the phone call. Do you want to buy our products? I'll think about it and call you back. I apologize for taking up so much of your time. Oh, no trouble at all. I'll call you back next week sometime. Okay, I eagerly await your call. I'd like to tell you about an incredible opportunity. I'm not interested in whatever you're selling. I'm hanging up. I wish I had more time to talk with you, but I have a meeting in ten minutes. All right, get back to your work. Is this Miss Wong? Yes. Who's calling, please? This is Miss Lee. I'm calling to apply for the assistance position. Is it still vacant? Yes. 
Have you ever been an assistant before? Yes, I've worked at AT Company. Do you have a resume? Yes, I could send you a copy of my resume by email. Okay, I'll read it and then think about it, and I'll call you soon. Okay, I'm looking forward to receiving your call. Unit 9 Power Off Connection Speak Up Noise Cut Off Slow Down Clearly Hear Somebody Well Echo Loud Cross Loudly Overload Out of order The subscriber you dialed is power off. The number you dialed is not be answered for the moment. Please redial later. Please dial area code before the number you dialed. The connection was bad. There was a lot of echo and I couldn't hear well. Pardon me? I can barely hear you. I can't hear you very well. What was the last part again? We were cut off just now. I cut you off by accident. The phone went dead. Could you speak up? Would you slow down, please? Please speak a little more slowly. The lines are crossed. The lines must be crossed. We have a bad connection. This is a really bad line. The line is busy. The line isn't free. Please bring those handouts to the conference room. I'm sorry. I didn't catch you. There is an echo on the line. There's a lot of noise in the background. Yes, I hear it too. I'll hang up and try again. What's wrong with your phone? I'm not sure, but I can't hear any dial tone. Sorry, but you are breaking up. I think we have a bad connection. I will call you back. What happened to your phone? I called you several times. Oh, God. The cord isn't plugged in. I kept getting a busy signal. Okay, let me have a look. I've just been disconnected from a number. Could you... I'm sorry. Could you speak a little louder? There's a bad connection. The connection is really bad. I've just been disconnected from a number. Is there something wrong with my phone? Oh, I doubt if it's your phone. There may be a fault in the line. I see. Please, tell me your number. I'll call you back as soon as the line is okay. My number's 8765-4321. About 10 minutes later. Hello. Is that 8765-4321? Yes. The line is okay now. There was a mini fault in it. Thanks for calling me back. Unit 10. Get a receipt. Hear from somebody. Suggestion. Send. 
assistance. Transmit a document. Look forward to. Feedback. Comment. Cooperation. Response. Attachment. Look forward to your feedbacks and suggestions soon. Your comments and suggestions are welcome. Feel free to give your comments. Any question, please don't hesitate to let me know. Please check at your side and comment. If you have any questions, please let me know. We are following your instruction on the basis of your confirmation. Once you respond to the above questions, we will decide which option we would like to pursue. Looking forward to hearing back from you tomorrow. Please advise us with your comments. Also, please let me know if you need any other information. Thank you so much for the cooperation. Thanks for the information. Your kind assistance on this are very much appreciated. Really appreciate your help. I really appreciate the effort you all made for this sudden and tight project. Thanks for your attention. Thanks for your understanding. Hope you have a good trip back. How are you? How is the project going on? CC Carbon Copy FYI For your information ASAP As soon as possible Resend. Please resend your reply to me. Mr. John Green, our general manager, will be in Paris from June 2nd to 7th and would like to pay a visit to you, say, on June 3rd at 2 p.m., about the opening of a sample room there. Please let us know if the time is convenient for you. If not, what time you would suggest? Thank you for your letter informing us of Mr. Green's visit during June 2nd through 7th. Unfortunately, Mr. Edwards, our manager, is now in Cairo and will not be back until the second half of June. He would, however, be pleased to see Mr. Green any time after his return. We look forward to hearing from you. We are sorry we cannot send you immediately the catalog and price list for which you asked in your letter of March 10th. Supplies are expected from the printers in two weeks, and as soon as we receive them, we will send you a copy. We are sorry to tell you that we have to cancel the appointment of the business group meeting that we had made which should be held in Beijing from October 10th to 13th, 2015. We can't arrange a convenient time before October because our project will last to the end of October. Please advise your service personnel and other concerned persons about our meeting cancellation at the earliest. Maybe we can set another time after October to meet again. We are really sorry about the cancellation and thank you for your understanding. We sincerely thank you and your staff for your past service. I am calling to make sure if you've got my email because I didn't get a receipt. I'm afraid I didn't get any of your emails. Don't worry. 
I will send it again right now. But I want to make sure the email address is absolutely right. It's cam at yahoo.com, right? Right. What documents will you send? Pictures of our latest production and their prices. How many pictures are there? 78. All the photos are digital ones with high resolution. I see. Please do not send the pictures by attachment. Put them in a single folder. Perhaps all the graphics should be zipped up into one archive? Got it. Please let me know your decision within a week in case the price would change. Yeah, I think it will be done in three days if there's nothing wrong.